ship to international waters. Now, we'll meet you there. All right, Frank, let's get the hell out of here. Full engines. No need, sir. Full engines stop now. Don, what do we do now? Stay outside and guard the boats. Rick, I know you're listening. Well, you guys were so friendly. You told me everything. So you did break into our system. I am a friend. Rick, please, just surrender. I'm waiting right here for you, Don. You want me? Pay the price. Right. No more radios. Use hand signals only. Out. some boats, man. James. What? James. I don't like it. How come there's no ghosts? Freeze, police! Shit.
les boises. line with these people. Don't let anybody come up behind us. Bill, Daniel. Yes, sir. Let's go. Your bun? Madam, why don't you sit over there? Go over there and stand guard. Quick. Take care of them for me. Madam, wait. Wait.
safer with this on. And you? I don't need it. What are you doing here? I didn't come out here as an observer. I'm part of this mission. Stay close to me. Where's James? He's dead. Ryan, report. Ryan. Drake, what? How are we supposed to get out of here now, man? God damn it. I'm thinking. Don't worry about it. Come on, Come on back. Come on back. Don't let them know there's only four of us. Distract them. Don't shoot unless necessary. Save your ammo. Disperse. Chum, can you hang on there? Yes, Sarge. Yeah, you piece of shit. I got something for you. Come and get some of this. Come on. <laughs> Come on, little boy. You want some shooting lesson? <laughs> Until Rick says it. Rick can't even make the decisions anymore. He's crazy. Yeah, I'm crazy.
Don't move. Don't move. Drop your gun. You're under arrest. You know the rest. Come on, Don. Never use an old trick. You told me that. You stupid son of a bitch. I could have made you rich.
Give me a license. Oh, sir. Lend me your bike. What about your vehicle? Don't worry. What about me? Call a taxi. Be right there. Yes, sir. Thanks. We have been trying to nail her for months, and you let her go. Are you out of your mind? You cannot mm. allow. Inspector Kwan is under my supervision. If you are not happy with her performance, you may file a complaint. But please, don't speak with such a loud voice. All right, that's enough. We're here to solve problems, not get in a fight. How many? 19. Finish it yourself. Okay. 7.62 again. Yeah, the usual stuff. From the groupings, though, it looks like they're pros. There's a lot of pros in Hong Kong. There sure are. Finished? Almost. I'm not finished. Sir. Seems we have a missing motorbike. We found it. When's your evaluation? I'm going next month. You read your psychological report? Uh, I'm just asking for a reevaluation. I'll make sure you get your transfer. I know. For the time being, sir, I'm still here. <clears throat> Can I go now? Not yet. Captain Guy's group. 
is in charge of finding this woman. I expect your full cooperation to help find her. I want her nailed. I'm setting up a special combined force. Since they're heavily armed, SDU will be attached. This case belongs to Customs, so all investigation will be handled by them. But sir, what about us? This is not your case. But anti-narcotics is much more capable than they are. If your people are so capable, Inspector, then why is she still at large? Now, until Internal Affairs is done investigating your department, your men are off this case. Is that clear? This investigation is under the Customs Bureau. Any objections? Stone Man escaped into confusion yesterday, and we haven't been able to find him anywhere since. Do you think they're going to have him killed? He's just a small potato. Now look what you've done. Sorry, sir. Oh, that's great. Now everyone knows we're here. Call maintenance. Clean your gun. Check your ammo. Hey, Sarge, this is boring. Well, I got an idea. Everybody, full gear, team drill, by the numbers. How's that? Come on, Sarge, you gotta be kidding. Hmm, you think so? Hey, Sarge, I didn't say anything. I think the Sarge is right. Cleaning your gun's good for you. Your gun is your life. It's even more important than your woman. And besides, I think this office is kinda nice. Nice? This is great. Look at the girls in here. <laughs> well, hmm? I don't know. Maybe they found something. Hey, they need you. We found an address at the crime scene. It could be important. Interesting. Have it checked immediately. What is SDU's opinion? We have none. We're a strike team. We don't do analysis. You give us a mission and we strike. We could search at the address. Okay. Minnie, Ty, and Thomas. All I'm sorry, three of you. Combat's not a game. They'll just be in the way. I thought you didn't have an opinion. But they don't even carry guns, right? That's been changed. All my female officers are fully armed and have been well trained. Oh, come on. Excuse me, Lieutenant. You want a mission. I'm giving it to you. You want it or not? Okay. Okay, ma'am. I just hope you know what you're doing. Be alert. No mistakes. Come on. 
Okay. You got everything. So let's go over this one more time. Oh. Oh, no, not again. Two men died, Bomber. I think they deserve some clarification for why they were killed. They fired at us. They're the bad guys. I want to make sure this is so. They were suspects. They didn't go to court and they surely didn't receive a death sentence. I want to make one thing clear to you people. We are part of the police force. We're not soldiers. Our job is to protect and to serve, to minimize casualties. Death is our failure, even if they are criminals. If any of you have a problem with that, you can go. If you ask me, Timmy's got the problem. Call for all. Shut your trap. You better learn to keep your mouth shut. Sorry, sir. Okay. Take five. No take five. Everybody, full gear. Yes, sir. Yes. So this guy's got a fucking attitude problem. Don, everybody can't be like you. It's just their job. It's their job? If they make a mistake, people lose their lives. But they've improved a lot already. It's not enough. Maybe you should go easy on them. Uh, Lieutenant Wong, could I see you, please? 
You're injured. You didn't know. Next time you decide to use your gun, don't shoot behind your partner's back. You might not be as lucky as I was. And another thing, don't you and your madam just do us all a big favor and turn this case back over to the narcotic people. You may not know this. You're dealing with something that's a bit beyond your comprehension. Look, Lieutenant, in case you have forgotten, this narcotics case is under our supervision. Your group has been called in to give us assistance. If you can't do that, then tell the commissioner. He'll understand. Rick! So what brings the DEA Rick, here? Good to see you. Good to see you, too. How you doing? Good, man. What brings you here? Yeah, right. Ice. Lots of ice. I presume you gentlemen know each other? <laughs> sure. I and I train together in the same thing. Good. Then let's get to work. We've checked the composition of the methamphetamine that we apprehended. It's identical to the stuff that the Gong Ang cartel has. You know, Rick, there must be at least a million dollars worth here. Yeah. You know something? We think it's only the same. You're kidding me. I tell you, our sources tell us someone's just put four tons of ice for the black. Four tons? How much is that worth? That's worth two and a half billion U.S. dollars. Just a lot of money. A lot of money? That's huge money. They say the richest man in America is Bill Gates. Not true. The richest man in America must be a drug dealer. Well, if the queen is here, that means the eyes can be here, too. That's why I'm here, Doug. This case is massive. My colleague Albert here speaks good Cantonese. He'll show you all the files relating to our case. Please understand, we're only here to assist you, not to monitor your work. If you feel uncomfortable with us at all, let me know. We'll disappear. Yeah, I think we need all the help we can get. Uh, Minnie, please show Albert the files. Uh, okay. Albert, this is Angel. Do you have access to the internet? Yeah, we do. Could you check this? Here's the access code. Mm -hmm. So do you like rock and roll? I like Andelau. So do I. My favorite song is Lovebird. We're ready, sir. Okay, all the way up to the 19th floor. Got it? Clear. Clear. Come on. Well done. It's a non-smoking world today. Yeah, well. It's a pain in the ass is what it is. But I bought you. Yeah, something. You know I don't smoke, Rick. <laughs> I'm just fooling with you. <laughs> I remember back in the camp, Don. You were straight out, always about business. No smoking, no drinking, no women. Hey, tell me, Tony. How's soon? We broke up. Okay. When? Last month. What the hell happened? I don't know. You know, it just just didn't work out. John, I feel lousy about that. That's a good woman. Well, how's your wife doing? <laughs> That's a different story, man. I didn't tell you about that. Oh man, Don, I got fucked. I quit my job in the field, put myself back in a desk. I haven't been in a desk since I was in school, for Christ's sake. She tells me, Rick, I'm in love with some guy. The guy's got some money, the guy's got an extra house, the guy's got a Porsche. She ain't in love with this guy, she's in love with his money. It's money, money, bitch. Good riddance. All right, all right. Tell me, how's the team? The team? Yeah, yeah. I got a great team, Rick. Mm -hmm. Some of the best I ever had. These guys, they, they work very hard, mm -hmm. these guys. Good to hear it, good to hear it. What about 97? What about it? Uh, from what I hear, you guys are gonna be flat empty. No equipment, no MP5s, no night vision goggles, no training, nothing. Hey. What do you do? It's all about the quality of the man, not the equipment. <laughs> 
Son, listen to you. Where the hell did you get that? That was like Jerry Miles, Little Red Book or something. Hey, he won, didn't he? What are they doing? They're learning CQB. Mm, what is CQB? CQB means close quarter battle. It's the latest technique. Oh, come on. Yeah, it's true. Study the new CQB pose. Basically, you begin like this. Your body is... I told you I can't make it tonight. Look, let's not go through this again. I wish you'd understand. You know how important my work is to me. Why don't you just forget it? Sorry. I don't know. Map, where are we going? Anything new? We're gonna search the apartment again. Again? I know that place inside out already. Well, let's go. We've gone through everything. Check one more time. I know we missed something. You heard her. <laughs> Nothing. I'm not surprised. <sighs> well? Nothing. Not a single thing. Keep looking. Oh, the phones are forensics. Did anyone check for calls? There's no other place you can get this kind of stuff. Bullshit! Okay, you wanna get the stuff? You talk to me and I'll send you the stuff on time. Yeah, okay? He said there's some other ice out there. What? The customs police are at the container yard. How could that be? They said it's a routine check. Ma'am, there's a shipping company's number on the phone bill. We did some checking and locked up 25 of the containers. Call SCU to, to stand by. Oh, come on. Just do it. Madam! I'll call headquarters. Help him. But the ice hit. Call an ambulance. Before you 
decided to risk your life, you should have called in the SDU. You know very well the suspects are heavily armed. This is precisely the reason the commissioner set up this special division. Minnie, I'm very disappointed. What were you thinking? Uh, with all due respect, madam, I think your men and, and women did their best. I told you she wasn't suitable for the job. You should be proud of her. I want your report by tomorrow. Have it in by night. Yes, ma'am. You're pretty unbiased sometimes. My opinion's unbiased. By discriminating? If you think being protective is discriminating, then I'm discriminating. Hey, wait. Thanks. Look, I don't want to make any problems. Let us handle the case. How do I make you understand? This case belongs to customs. This is our job. You might think we're not capable. I admit we're shorthanded. But tell me something. If everybody threw their dangerous cases to the SDU, could you handle it? Look, we can handle it. What if you couldn't? Who would you throw the ball to? You never give up, do you? That's right. Neither do you. That's good. China. They declared it as toys. It's owned by a trading firm. There's only one problem, though. The company isn't registered. There are thousands of containers in Hong Kong. How are we going to find it? Hi, Thomas. These men are customs investigators. They're not soldiers. What are we doing this for? I'll tell you why. It's our lives we put on the line, whether we like it or not. You should know that. Come on. Can you take a break? Yes, sir. Hey, I heard that the Anti-Narcotics Bureau is back in the Special Division. It's about time. What about customs? They wouldn't kick them out. Think how embarrassing it would be. <laughs> Ain't no. Get your toolbox. What for? Just do it. Just do it. For some mysterious reason, they designed the baby browning so that the hammer locks after every shot. Therefore, you have to release the trigger completely before you can fire again. No, I don't want you to feel bad. It's not because you're so tense that you can't fire quick enough. That's just the way that the gun is designed. But we can solve that problem, eh, Joe? Would anybody else like to try? But ma'am, that's against regulations. Nobody's gonna find out. Ready, oh, ready. Having fun? Cracking. Thank you. That's okay. I don't like to see anybody unhappy. You got some good guys there. Are you having problems with Commissioner Pong? Is that intuition? Just hearsay. 
and your girl? Did you get dumped? Is that hearsay? Six cents. Officer Lau, someone's looking for you at reception. Yeah. Fine, send him up. Any new leads? Ah, Captain, you came right on time. I was just on the phone with Mr. D. He's giving a stone man. Come on. Inspector Lau, they all say they're stone man. You are all stone man? Yeah, that's right. And there's 20 more of us. What you gentlemen are holding are the addresses of these businesses in Kowloon. I want you to sweep his street clean. You see a face you don't like? You bring him in. He's gone too far. He's insulted this department. I want to put a little pressure on him. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Dismissed. What are you waiting for? There's work to be done. Yes, sir. Bungling idiot. At around midnight last night, about 200 PTU, together with anti-narcotics officers from Kowloon's side, initiated massive raids in some clubs and suspected drug joints in both Sham Po and Mong Kok. 18 kilograms of heroin and a small portion of marijuana were seized in the operation. 30 men and 4 women were detained for questioning. The police department declared that the operation has not been put to an end, but instead will be ongoing for a couple of weeks to put pressure on drug-related activities in the district. Hold on, please. Inspector Lau, Mr. D on line 1. Yeah? Look, Lau, what kind of games are you trying to play? What are you talking about? Your cops are all over my street. Everyone's keeping away. You're ruining my business. Look, we're not trying to interrupt your business. We're just going after a few drug dealers. You don't want those slime balls on your street, do you? Oh, I get it. Your cops want to look good before 97 when you lose your jobs, huh? Now hold on. We're not going anywhere. I'm getting tired of you hoods telling us what we can and can't do. You got some nerve, big businessman. You're a crook. Nothing more. Uh, now look, Mr. D. Let's not argue. Let's cooperate. All I want is some information. Is that too much to ask? Our target's here. Ting Yi Island. An abandoned factory. Operation Code Snowman. Okay, I'll just play that level well, for you then. Come on, come on. Why are you all? Come, come on, man. 148. Shit. Huh? Who won? Who won? Which one won? 147. I told you to put it on 147. You had to put it on 148. I got a date with this chick tonight, man. Where am I going to bump the money for that? Why don't you rob a bank? Hey, Daniel. I've seen this girl. She's not your type. <laughs> hey, lock and load. Party time. Sniper, seaside ready. Approaching.
Seaside on hold. Team 50 yards apart, sweep up the hill. Let's go. B team, B side on hill. Request medevac. All units provide support immediately. Inside C. 
Docs, how is he? He's all right. He's stable. But I'm sorry we couldn't save his legs. Excuse me. Did anyone call his family? He doesn't have a family. You mean to tell me those guys were police? No. An MP5 is a law enforcement weapon. You can't find it in the private sector, even in the black market. Tomorrow, I want you to give me a copy of everybody's bank statement, including yours. What? I want to find out who's in debt. Because of the MP5s? Joe, would you just do it? Fuck you. What? Fuck you! Come here. I'm dissolving the special division. In any case, it's the Army's problem now. This is a police matter. This is my decision. I expect you to comply. Also, inform all your men. There's going to be an investigation. Internal affairs... No! No internal affairs! That's an order! No internal affairs! You want my investigation? I'll give you an investigation. You want my resignation? I'll give you my resignation. But don't give me this internal affairs bullshit. If I see these guys on my complex, you're going to see a lot of dead bodies. That's bullshit! Done! son it's mom yesterday was your dad's birthday did you forget again i bought a pipe as a present i'll tell him it's from you give me a call when you have time uh mr wong this is mr ma from asia jewelry calling the diamond ring that you ordered has been ready for a long time if you don't pick it up soon i'm afraid we must take your deposit Reports from the firearms people indicates that these guys are soldiers, not SDU. What they're using is a mine called the Claymore. It's an explosive device used by the U.S. military. Rick told me to check on all the veterans and mercenaries to see if any of them are in Hong Kong. So far, nothing looks suspicious. What are we going to do now? We'll do the best we can with what we have. That's the spirit. Just because you haven't got an office, doesn't mean you can't get these guys and put him away for good. It's bad news. The price of methamphetamine just dropped 20% in the States. So what's that mean? There's only one reason the price falls like that. A larger supply. I think our stuff just arrived in the States. Son of a bitch. I would pack up. We're going back to the States tomorrow morning. Bomber's Game Boy. I'll take it to him. Do you think I can do to help? Oh, You burn yourself too much on this one. You would deal with a bunch of Gambo types out there. They're professionals, they're warriors. Hey, Rick, what do you think we are, a bunch of Boy Scouts? Look, Don, I know you're having some serious trouble with your boss. Rick, if you need my help, you can call me anytime. I'll use my connection. We'll work something out. Thanks, Rick. You're welcome. Don, you know you're always welcome.
Tell Inspector Poon that he'll have his office back by tomorrow. All set? Yeah. How's your China doll? Did you get a farewell kiss? Uh. Let's go have a drink. Rick. What? Let's go back to the embassy. I know about the Charlie team. Are you out of your mind? What are you talking about? The Navy SEAL team working with us in Burma. Last contact was three weeks ago. No one uttered a word. And you are the commanding officer. They're still in Burma. They're here! The moment I heard about the Claymore, I knew it was one of ours. Why, Rick? Look, you can join us. It's drug money. So what? It's two billion dollars. It's fucking drug money. It's fucking drug money, Think you guys fucked up, huh? Yeah, well maybe you did. But you're not the best. And you're not the worst either. You remember Operation Urgent Fury? Granada, 86. 6,500 US soldiers. Delta Force, Navy SEALs and Rangers. They're going up against 50 Cubans and 2,000 militia. And the results were disastrous. It was a mess. They had a group of SEALs that were dropped out of a C-130 and they all drowned. The pilot was flying too low. Then we got a two, two, two Cobra helicopters flying over the jungle, sent in to, to pick up a team of SEALs who were under attack, supposedly. It turns out that they weren't even under attack. They were lying for help. They panicked. And these are some of the best people that are trained. And we're not superheroes. And we may have failed, okay? We were up against a power that we, we were unaware of. I guarantee you this, though. We're not going to fail again. I promise you that. We will not fail again. and the injury of nine others. He has requested the commissioner of police to give him a report concerning the case as soon as possible. The governor has also expressed concern for the families of the deceased. There's no place that I could hide myself So I decide to stay until I
Ferrari. Yeah, we got one up, three to go. Don, I need to see you. Can you call me? Good afternoon, sir. Yeah, uh, two, please. Right this way, sir. Would you like a menu? Uh, I'm just going to have a cup of coffee. Okay, Thank you. have a seat. Immigration. He never left Hong Kong. So check out Rick. Rick says he left. Albert was working on something. Your friend Rick has a deal with a shipping firm. I talked to Inspector Lau. He feels Rick's connection isn't a coincidence. This ship has been anchored offshore for three weeks now. Why is it standing by? What's it waiting for? So what's your plan? I want to inspect it, but I need SDU. Will you help us? The main purpose of the Claymore is not to kill. It's more to handicap, to maim you, making you a burden to your partners. Its explosive range is 50 meters laterally and 2.4 meters vertically. So you really don't need too many of these to cover a large area. Bon, since you're on point, you have to learn to defuse these. I'm depending on you. Yes, sir. Gentlemen, I want everybody in full gear. We're going boating. Double ammo for everybody, Joe. Okay, everybody, move! <laughs> Sorry. What? At the hospital the other day, I kind of lost it. Oh, I guess I should trust everybody. Sometimes I think you guys can't do the job without me. I was wrong. And I think that fucking attitude problem comes from me. Thanks, Joe. You can think it over. You don't have to go. I have. I'm going. Okay, let's go. Hey. I'm not pleased with this time. You're taking another big risk. Sir, we were ambushed. Sir, if we fail, then you can get rid of a commander you dislike very much. But if you call on the army now, no SDU will be able to walk around with their heads up. They'll lose their morale. This is our job, sir. This could ruin your career. If I don't do this, sir, my career's worth nothing. I promised the commissioner we'd stay clear. And I intend to keep that promise. You may have a live ammunition drill. Low profile, minimal exposure. And should you have any problems, you'll call the military. Yes, sir. Go on. Thank you, sir. Don. Take care. I'll need somebody to blame. You got it, sir. Hurry up!
Nothing on our side. Panther, what about you? Nothing either, madam. Okay, copy. So how big is four tons of ice? As big as a cargo container. So I guess it's not here then. Diver team, report. D team, no movement. Okay, over. Don, the diving team has been next to the ship for over 10 hours. Do you want to call it off? Minnie, the last time you called Rick, what number did you use? His cellular phone number. Can you give it to me? He's around. I can feel it. Here. Have headquarters stand by. If he's still in Hong Kong, we can trace the call. Okay. Hey, Rick. It's Don. Hey, Don. What's up? Oh, we're still trying to solve that ice case, you know. Ah, come on, Don. Don't waste your time. That stuff's in Mexico already. You had to smuggle it in small pieces. Ice and average, I'm going to take care of it. So you think it's the cartel? Yeah, you know how much they hate the guys in the Golden Triangle. It's kind of fun to see those druggies shoot each other up, though. We found it. It's G7. Yes, it's in zone G7. We got it. We got it. Hey, Rick, can you do me a favor? Sure. What? Can you send me all the information you have on the SEALs and Delta Force operating around Asia? Are you serious? Well, I think these are the guys we're looking for. Why? Weapons, tactics, everything. Jesus, Don, that's a bit sensitive. Well, I know. That's why I'm counting on you. Okay, I'll see what I can do. She's between friends. Don, you are my best friend. I know. I always will be. Hey, Rick. Say hello to Albert for me, would you? All right, Don, you take care. Yeah, you too. He knows. What are you talking about? Vincent, wake them in. We're moving out. What now? I thought we had three days. Change of plans, gentlemen. Call Oscar. Tell him to get the ship ready. You heard the man. Come on, everybody up. Get up. Let's go. Move. Go up. Everybody up. What the fuck is going on? The old man said move. Three at four o'clock in the morning. Give me a break. Come on, son. Come on, Everybody up. Let's go. Up. Get up. My Let's dream go. was the best piece of ass I've ever looked. Got about five seconds to get. What's he all nervous? <laughs> I don't know. It must be those Boy Scouts. <laughs> G7 
VR 203 <laughs> Bosco, bring the ship to international waters. Now, we'll meet you there. All right, Frank, let's get the hell out of here. Full engine. No need, sir. Full engine stop now. Stay outside and guard the boats. Turn around! I know you're listening. Well, you guys were so friendly. You told me everything. So you did break into our system. I am a friend. Rick, please, just surrender. I'm waiting right here for you, Don. You want me? Pay the price. Ryan, no more radios. Use hand signals only. Out. some boats, man. James! What? James! I don't like it. How come there's no ghosts? Freeze! Police! Shit!
We got company, boys. line with these people. Don't let anybody come up behind us. Bill, Daniel. Yes, sir. Let's go. Your bun? Madam, why don't you sit over there? Go over there and stand guard. Quick. Take care of them for me. Madam, wait. Wait.
You're gonna be safer with this on. And you? I don't need it. What are you doing here? I didn't come out here as an observer. I'm part of this mission. Stay close to me. Where's James? He's dead. Ryan, report. Ryan. Drake, what? How are we supposed to get out of here now, man? God damn it. I'm thinking. Don't worry about it. Come on, Come on back. Come on back. Don't let them know there's only four of us. Distract them. Don't shoot unless necessary. Save your ammo. Disperse. Jump. Can you hang on there? Yes, Sarge. Yeah, you piece of shit. I got something for you. Come and get some of this. Come on. <laughs> Come on, little boy. You want some shooting lesson? <laughs> Dead. We're this on our not through until Rick says it. Rick can't even make the decisions anymore. He's crazy. Yeah, I'm crazy.
Don't move. Don't move. Drop your gun. You're under arrest. You know the rest. Come on, Don. Never use an old trick. You told me that. You stupid son of a bitch. I could have made you rich. Seduced by the dark side, he was. 2.5 billion. Would you do it? Oh, I don't know. As long as no one got hurt, I probably would. But no one should have that much money. But hey, stop frowning. We're done. It's just another day. It never ends. It never ends. We're paid to worry. I thought you knew that. Oh, yeah. But I'm not gonna frown. It gives you wrinkles. 